Hey guys, today is July 14th, so it is exactly one month since uh, my last video of my pumpkin patch. A lot of things have occurred since then. This is my scarecrow. Um, I planted, these were the seeds that I actually planted on my own, and they have come up and are actually doing quite well. I had to clear out this entire area because my pumpkins were actually starving for nutrients and I so I cleared out this area and I had to thin out my pumpkins um, if you remember this this set right here was actually about seven pumpkins and now there are only four in there or three and that one only has three this is just one plant right here and he recently fell over today so I'm a little worried about him um, but they all look really really well you can see underneath there um, a lot of vine growth, a lot of new leaf growth. Um, I'm putting miracle Grow on them once a week. And I water them pretty consistently every single day. Um, I did have cracks on the primary vines. And the way I fixed that, um, just from what I saw online, is that I took the primary vine and I actually just buried it. So here you can see that it used to go down to here and I buried it to... Um, cause new root formation so I'm hoping that that's really going to help uh, I have this plant has plenty of male flowers um, but no female I've not found any female flowers yet but these flowers you know open in the mornings exactly the way they're supposed to uh, but not yet had any female flowers and I haven't seen any bees around those but I haven't been watching them in the morning so I don't know I actually thinned some of my plants out and one of them my wife suggested that I replant so I have one here that I've replanted and he doesn't look too hot. My wife actually named it Cinderella so I guess it's a she. <laughs> and uh, But I'm trying to get it back to life there. Uh, none of my vines are currently running out the way they're supposed to but I think they're starting and how you can tell is that this one actually from there is starting to have the kink all the way out and that's a good sign that this one is the runner vine there and that's the other one they're all doing quite well the runners are I had no problems with squash vine borers um, I came out and checked mine daily and then it is now middle way through July so they shouldn't actually be coming out anymore so I don't I don't know what the if we just didn't have any in this area or if I just got lucky. Um, nothing else to report. All of them seem to be doing good. Just waiting for them to vine and start producing more male and female plants. So I will be filming again September the 14th or August the 14th. Uh, check back in. Thanks guys.